Uh, hi, so welcome to the MuleSoft tutorials. In this video, we'll discuss about the what uh, what is flow in a Mule. So in last video, we have created one test project, which is test proj, and we have gone through the any point any point studio. What are the functionality any point studio provides? So in this pro in this uh, video tutorial, we'll go through and create few flows and we'll understand the concept of flow. Okay, so we have this, let's say you can type on palette flow, you can call drag it to the canvas. Yeah, here it is. So this is basically a flow and uh, it contains basically flow is uh, uh, we are we have one message. We have we are transferring message from one connector to another and we are basically transferring let's say i want to transfer one i put one logger over here and again i put to let's say uh, sftp so basically this is a flow we have our system over here and we can add one source let's say source is http okay so once uh, we receive a request over here it will go to the logger first and then it goes to the sftp so this is a sequential manner right so it always goes in a sequential manner we can make flow as uh, asynchronous and synchronous asynchronous means uh, it will run in a background and it will not wait for the response synchronous means in a linear fashion so once you click on the flow, you can see a processing strategy over here and you can check the processing strategy, whether it is asynchronous, we can change it to the synchronous if you want. And there are a few more like uh, queued sync asynchronous, queued thread per process, non-blocking. So according to our need, we can change the processing strategy over here. And, and then we have error handling in flow. So we have like if something not working out and we got some exception at the runtime, we, we we need to handle that exception. So for that, we have exceptions in MuleSoft. So we can drag and drop and whatever exception we're getting, we can give execute when and then we can insert a say logger inside. So some exception is coming. It will goes to this situation. It will go to this block and it will run the whatever we have inside the catch exception strategy. So basically, flows are basically a sequential running in flows run in a sequential manner. And uh, we we have more than one flow. We can use uh, let's say I create a one more flow and uh, I can use uh, flow reference to call a flow from one flow to another flow. I need to give a, let's say this is my second flow. I can save it. So this will take me to this flow and will process will start in the same way sequential manner. Here also we have error handling. So in this tutorial, we have gone through what is flow and uh, in the next video we'll go through how many types of flow we have and what are the difference between that flows okay see you then